dogs live, but it's one of those ones where you better be uh, in your line or else it's gonna, you know. It'll, it'll swap you, dude. Yep. It's a good. It's a good hit, I imagine, dude. Yeah. Be. Second gear on it, third gear cruising. Yeah. Cruising. Yeah. Just make sure you stay in it. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Actually, I have, I think I have pictures in my phone of my buddies. Crazy ass shit off this, this and my ramp. But put your ramp up down here, right? Yep. Um, when we set it up short, it's usually right where that um, one trail starts to go up. So okay. it's about like 40, maybe 50 foot gap, and it's just second gear, just, just real easy. Yep. Just come in, whoop. like a kind of like an idle speed, and then whoop. Yep. Just at the bottom of the ramp. Just Perfect. Every time. What's that? Come out here with a stick. Oh, yeah. It's a oh, blast. Shit. Yeah. And it's like whipping it off these like D's and like the uh, um, track jumps and all that. You know how it can be difficult sometimes because it's not the, same, it's not the same, same hit yeah. every time. Yeah. Ramp every same. time. So, so you can get a dial, dude. You dude. can lean into it too, huh? Oh, <laughs> this kid, um, Eddie, he goes out to the Sandy Valley track like um, probably every time. Actually, I think he raced last time and won um, in his class, the 450 class, in like the 20s or like 20 or 30 or teens, I don't know. But anyway, um, on our smaller ramp that we have, it's only about like three feet, three and a half feet wide. The motherfucker would come up just putting in second gear, da, 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 sitting down, seat bouncing, leaning off like this, of course. And he would hit the left, or he, yeah. would, he, he would hit the left on the top and then the right on the bottom. So he would come in on the right side and then just fucking rock. Yeah. Yeah, I watched the ramp rock. I was like, damn, <laughs> motherfucker. But shortly after that, he kind of came up a little bit short. 